Everyone, good evening guys. So we're going to be doing another stream today, as you can probably tell. Um, so this is what I've kind of tried to plan. My webcam, I still can't get it to work. I have I have no idea what's happened to my webcam. It might just be that, well, I know that it works because I, I did the update video, but for some reason it just doesn't work with the with OBS anymore. It's like, uh, it's like it's blocked, but it's not. It's, it's bizarre. Um, so yeah, guys, going to be doing a stream. Um, it looks like from the... Uh, kind of straw poll that I put up, which um, if you guys don't know already, I'll put the straw poll up on Twitter and also on Discord. Um, so if you follow me on one of those, you will see the straw poll when it comes up, uh, which is always quite good. Um, but I don't know what else. There we go. We've got a couple of people. So we've got Stitch and Stand plays. Good to see you, man. You did say that you're going to be on. I'm a bit late as well. I've got Sydney Fireworks. We've got Alan Snippy. Snippy? Snipey? Um, Carlos Talavera. Hey, how's it going, Carlos? Um, yeah, we also got uh, Player Raven, A. Hey, how's it going, man? And also Emma Warner. Um, Sydney says, love the boots. Love the boots. Well, that's good. Um, so, yeah, anyway, we're going to do some Silver Siege. Silver Siege. So, wow, look at that. It's so small in the little thing. There we go. That made, made that a bit bigger. That'll, that'll look a lot better. Um, <laughs> strange. So, I've only just started up Minecraft now. Just finished my dinner. I also got Ryan the 13th as well. We've got Drunk Yoda. Wow, Drunk Yoda. That's a new name. Interesting, isn't it? Very interesting. Um, who else we've got? We've got Tyler from State Farm. Okay, cool. Cryptic Streams as well. Big Mac. Always got to have the Big Mac. Um, yeah, so uh, how's it all going, guys? How's, how's everything going? It's been a bit of a busy week for me. <laughs> so doing that castle tutorial, the hour and 44 minutes, I did it over two, two days. Um, I just thought I'd show you guys this quickly. Very, very quickly, in fact. Um, very quickly, because I've I've been doing a little bit more work. I've not been doing loads, because um, I was going to do it on stream if we get a stream. But um, yeah, been just trying to shape it up a little bit and put in where the rigging's going to go. And I've put in the middle mast. I think it's too big. But I'm not sure yet because I can't quite remember. But it it actually no, it's not too big. It actually looks right. But I'm really happy with how the shapes turned out for the back piece. Um, really, really happy. So yeah, I've uh, been doing a little bit of that and trying to figure out everything. Uh, recently I went up to the Portsmouth Historic D Dockyard and there um, I got to, to go on to the HMS Victory and HMS Warrior. Um, I did not see that message at all. Sorry dudes. I have no idea what it was. But um, yeah, I got to see the Historic Dockyard. I got to see uh, HMS Warrior, HMS Victory. And because of that I was like, ah, actually yeah, things that I've done in Minecraft are wrong. Um, which is good. Because <laughs> it makes you makes you kind of like think about things. So yeah, the back of the ship, especially Boeing like this, um, really does happen. Really does. The victory it is so crazy. I can't show you guys the pictures yet. Uh, I hope I can at some point. So yeah, I've tried to do that kind of like here. So it actually does bow this way, even though the rest of the ship is bowing outwards, and that's because of the centre part of it. So that's where that's where that's from. It does happen. Kind of that. I couldn't tell actually on 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 the victory if it had any at all. Um, so I'm not really too sure, but. It's, it's really weird. It's really cool though. So yeah, that's that's kind of what I've been doing. So I've got like these areas here and these will work their way up. It does go to the walkway at the top on this bit, which is quite cool. So there you go, you got the walkway for this bit. And this isn't the captain's cabin either. I think this feels like a captain's cabin. I don't know why, it just, just kind of does. But um, but it's it's not. It's the uh, other one. So i got to put a couple of cannons in. But yeah, the captain's cabin is quite small at the top, actually. It's like, it's only this big. <laughs> It's really tight, like tidy and and crushed in, but I guess they can see whoever they've got hanging in there. So it's it's a little bit different. Uh, anyway, a little bit, a little bit different. All right. So anyway, what we're gonna do? Sorry, guys. Right. Let me just have a chat to everyone. So we got Shula as well. How's it going, Shula? Good to see you, Shula. Um, we've also got Davy Sm David Smiley. Sorry. Um, was just making the sixteen by sixteen castle on five. Cool, man. Tell me how you find it, because obviously I haven't built it in survival, but I've tried I tried really hard to get the materials right for it. Um, but obviously stuff like mossy stone brick doesn't doesn't really work. But yeah, you know, let me know how it is. Let me know if it's alright. Oh yeah. Yeah, I was supposed to warp somewhere else. I'm on I'm on the um uh at the minute I'm on the Roman island because uh I was thinking where can I start? <laughs> this was happening the other day, and I've just been looking around, and I was like, ah, this this might work for something like small. I want to start with something really, really small, like really small, like like a villa again, because I, I really like doing the villa. So I was just having a quick look. Anyway, 
Enough of that. Yeah. <laughs> Don't need that yet. Do not need that yet. Silver Sage, there you go. We'll, we'll go over and have a look there. Uh, we also got Car Powell. I'm good, man. Thank you very much. Um, Stitch and Sand's doing some good building in Minecraft. Uh, now in your Roman world. Cool, man. That sounds good. Um, I, like, like I just said, definitely going to get back into the Roman at some point. Um, Sydney Fireworks make more well, yachts. I've done a update video which also had a vote video in it, so you can have a look at the results in there um, if, you, if you want to. So yachts was one of the things that was on there, um, so you can kind of see how it is on the plan. But I do advise you watching that video because um, that kind of like helps. Uh, what is this app? This app, what Minecraft or or the um, journey, journey map? So if it's the map, then it's journey map. Unfortunately, I'm behind. I'm always behind on the comments. I'm really behind at the minute. Um, so yeah, it's journey map, but uh, if that's it. Thanks Shula for saying it's a pretty awesome ship. Got Jinxus as well. Good ass ship, bro. Thanks, man. <laughs> it's getting there. Um, Sydney likes modern boats more. It's one of those things. They they take so much time. That's the only problem with them with the modern boats. I think this did have like a stone floor, so I'm gonna gonna start just like throwing down some blocks here. Uh, yep. Yeah. I'm gonna go like this. Gonna get them have like a kind of bit. Damp, horrible stone. Fl I don't know if this works actually. I was going to do this. <laughs> now I'm looking at it going. Mm. And this one's really weird. It's, it's so cool. It is really damn cool, but yeah, I just. That's not going to work. This is definitely not going to work. That one kind of works if we mix that. Oh, okay, let, let me have a look. All right, let's go with that one, that one. That one. <laughs> there we go. And while I'm at it, let's just do well edit instead. So I can just play some blocks and I can just like talk to you guys with with uh, at the same time. So anyway, um Shula says the skeleton block is interesting. What do you mean interesting? That's what that's the closest thing that we could get to it. Um looking at all the pictures that we had, all the reference pictures we had, that was the closest that we could get. What the hell kind of render this amount? Just far oh, okay. Just seems a bit laggy today. It's really laggy actually. What is going on? It's just like... It's weird. Because <laughs> I'm like watching my FPS and I'm going, it doesn't, it doesn't seem to be dropping, it's just it feels a little bit glitchy, so... Hmm, weird. I've not had that before, not properly like this, anyway. It's also weird that it's on, uh, not on like 60. It's usually like, when I've just got it on normal, it's, it's usually way up there. Ah, but then again... What do I have the floor for? Like floor over, and not floor the these these fields. No, I went with my low lag farmland. Oh, I have no idea. No idea at all. Hmm. Anyway, uh, we also got uh, what was that cryptic uh, streams as well? Cool, we got cryptic streams. Sister Sad says hello, dos yich bent uk Netherlands. That was so bad. I cannot read Dutch at all. It just does not work. <laughs> I tried. You know, whatever. Um, <laughs> uh, Shula, you want to start with something small, but I promise you it'll turn into something like a city. Oh, what, Shula? Yeah, yeah, definitely, yeah. I've I've got to figure out what I'm going to do with that whole place, if I'm honest. Um, like I've been looking at it, and I, for some reason, I thought it was a lot smaller. And then I jumped over there the other day, and I went, "Oh, it's it's absolutely huge as an island. It's 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 monstrous, really." Um, and that's not really helped because <laughs> I was before, you know, worried yeah, I'm not I'm going to run out of space or something. And now I'm like, I've I'm never going to fill this space. So I don't know. Bizarre. Who knows? All right. Okay. Anyway, mask that. That looks horrible. Which one's the hewn stone? That one. So that's number four. Uh, let's try. Where is it then? No, it's there. It's number four. Let's try like 50% of that, 25% of the others. I'll probably change it. Uh, actually, no, let's go with 25. Let's go with. Let's go 55, for example. Yeah. What am I trying to do here? 55. 25 now. 55. Oh, what's that? 20? 15? Whatever. 
God damn it. That looks so bad. That looks <laughs> so damn bad. <laughs> oh man, that's so bad. Hey Bart, it's good to see you man. Um, anyway, right, 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 right. So we've got Meme as well. Uh, wasn't here for so long. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> um, what do I think about the Elder Scrolls series of games, man? I loved Oblivion. I, I've, I got uh, Morrowind, actually, after I'd played Oblivion. I, I just never got into it, but apparently the storyline's amazing, so I need to go back and and stuff. Uh, we've got Primitive Panther as well. Nice to see you on the stream. Haven't been able to catch you before. Oh, cool, man. Thanks, thanks for coming on. Um, anyone else finding this more delay than usual? That's me, Shula. Um, I'm so behind on the... I'm actually scrolling on the chat. Future Epicness, good to see you, man. Good to see that you're on Twitch as well. I used to play on the server a few years ago. That's cool. Oh, we've got Morgan Develt as well. Caught me on a coffee break. Oh man, is it is it like normal time for you then? Like like work time? It's like seven thirty nine p.m. for for me in the UK. Uh, Green Tuber, uh, what mod am I using? This Conquest Reforged mod. There's a link in the description on the YouTube video, which I can see that you're in on or even. So uh, yeah, you can go and grab the mod pack. It's actually it's it's a mod, but there's also a pack with it because there's a lot of the other stuff. Uh, Princess Miranf missed so much of Silver Stage build. Um, have you? Ah oh, man sucks but you know yeah we, I mean the only thing we did is this angled um, actually looks really good as an angled build God, we did good on this or I did good on this and uh, you guys helped me yeah that's it's actually looking good <laughs> don't know why I'm so surprised but you know uh, yeah it's, it's it's looking quite cool um, I just need to do more like that that's that's really um, I think the gentle slope really works actually now I'm thinking about it. I think that's what it is obviously um, right, well, th this horrible floor that we got here, I'm just going to end up just, like, replacing it with some of these, because uh, it just does not look right at all. It just looks absolutely horrible with that other material in there. And we'll just go with it being, you know, mostly the other stuff, and I'll just put a couple blocks or whatever. Um, right, anyway, and then I'll catch up on the... It's really difficult. I'm really struggling at the minute with reading the entire chat and building. And I don't know why. It's just really good. Uh, Dutch was amazing. Yeah, it was it was dreadful. It was, it, honestly, stitching stand that is the worst Dutch that I've ever done. I cannot read it. I cannot read it. Like if you said um, if if you said how do you write that, I couldn't write it. If you wrote it down, I wouldn't be able to read it. <laughs> bed bed rip <laughs> something like that. Do you know what I mean? Um, Dark Wolf has it going as well. All right. Future Epicness, you've now switched to YouTube. I can read it on both, uh, so don't worry about that. So you can, you can, if you want to watch it on Twitch, you can watch it on Twitch. Um, I've got the uh, like restream, so I've got the joint chat. It's really cool. Um, Prince Panther, I feel like you've already showed it, but uh, where is Silver Sage located in Arrowhead? Not a problem. Um, it is basically in Vestia. So Vestia is where we were, you know, building uh, Wagrandale is all the way over there. Uh, well, I say all the way over there. It's literally over the mountains. Uh, so Wagrandale's over here. It's on the other side of the mountains where we've got like this little, little town. Not really a town. Little village. Little village. I think it would be more of a village. So that's where it is. Um, so that's not too bad. So we've got that here. So, you know, uh, Hamburg is like miles away. It's really laggy today. I don't know why. No idea why. It's a bit weird actually. A bit worrying. Um, yeah, Hamburg's it's just struggling. I don't know why. There you go. So that's where Hamburg is. <laughs> really far away. So that's where we're at. Right, okay. Well, I'll put that up so that you guys can, can like see where it is. And there's. Oh, thank you very much, uh, Bart. recently got a new job, so I've got to keep the Mueller somewhere. Cool. Thank you so much, Love man. Love you and your videos, D A K R. Keep it going. Thank you very much, bud. So thank you very much for the two pound fifty-seven. I have no idea why the text, uh, the the writing part of it, just didn't work. Um, that was a bit weird. <laughs> really, really weird. But thank you so much, dude. Thank you for the donation. Um, Big Mike would love love to hear me speak Finnish. We also got Blazer's cat as well. Mitch is here. Mitch is here indeed. Uh, I just repeated exactly what Mitchy said, which is really creepy because I read Mitchy's name, then said Mitchy's here. And then it below us is much easier. Weird. Anyway, uh, we've got Nikki Lund as well. Hey, how's it going? Um, Big Mike, you've heard it's Dutch. Don't please put me through. Just speak finish. No, good God, no. Um, Morgan Develt, American. Coffee break is over. Fair enough, man. Thank you very much for coming on. Uh, Griefer of Minecraft. That doesn't sound good. Thanks for the help on the 747. No, no worries, man. I'm going to be doing a bigger one at some point as well. I have started building it, actually. Um, 
I need an airport though for it. I really need an airport for it. So we'll, we'll kind of see how that goes. Um, since I'm pocket edition texturing is horrible. Just everything is block by block. Yeah. Right. Anyway, mountains of silver stage make it an interesting shape. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, because they're just in the back there. I know I've got it on normal. It's because it's because of weird lag that I've got at the minute. I'm not really too sure what's going on. It could be the the restream um, chat actually, because it seems to be a. a I don't want to say it's a badly written um, bit of software. I think hurriedly, hurriedly written, that's the right word. Uh, right, we need doors. Anyway, yeah, I think it's been written quite quickly. So I, I'm, it might be that. I don't really know. I'll have, I'll, next time I'll just do it normal and see what happens. Right, so he's going to have... It's not really in, like super fancy doors. I don't think we need a super fancy door, come to think of it. I might have this uh, built down actually, so it's like you have like similar to like this where you've got like a little wall. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm totally gonna do that. So yeah, the plan is today anyway, guys. Uh, do I think a little bit of interior of this? Well, yeah, do do some interior of this. Should I say instead? Um, yeah, let's do like that. Get that in there. Uh, do an interior on this and. Um, if we if we have time, we'll we'll start building something else. So that's that's the kind of plan. Uh, really good plan, that. <laughs> really insightful. Um, that's, that's about it. <laughs> just <laughs> I don't know why. I was just thinking like maybe I had more of a plan than that kind of plan. It just seemed. It was in my head that that sounded like a lot, but it is not at all. <sighs> Who knows? All right, let's do that. There we go. Do something like that. And then we can, uh, let's just grab all these blocks. That one, that one, and that one, and that one, and whatever else we got. I have not done... Uh, I have over here, okay. Uh, give me a sec, let's grab these instead. Oh yeah, I was using a lot of that one, I don't really like it anymore. Mm, there we go, use that as well, cool. Right, where am I? That way. That way. Um, right, so if we put... Oh yeah, I can't really do that because of that block there. So stupid. Right. Do that instead. Uh, what we could do, though, is push this one back into the corner. Or something like that. Right. I'm going to put these in, then catch up on the chat, because I'm already getting behind. Um, so, yeah, what I'm going to do as well, guys... Um, I'm gonna also be starting to do some uh, bring back those kind of like little mini let's build series that I was doing before because um, yeah I've been missing them I'm actually been missing them so I don't like this that that one I don't like it the loft flooring one it doesn't fit with this this thing that we got going on here <laughs> at all I, yeah it's that one isn't it hey thank you very much um, Lucrania77 for following me man even though I can't see that you're actually following me. Oh, or watching, sorry. That's really bizarre. Why is the counter not working? Let me refresh it. Yeah, still not working. But yeah, thanks so much, man. Thanks for the follow. Really do appreciate it. Um, oh, I just did I get the same block? No, I didn't. It's that one. Yeah, I think this one just looks better. It just fits fits with the colours a lot better. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna bring bring back the mini uh, um, kind of little let's builds like we did with the next romance layer that's over there. Um, because I think we need to start fleshing out the, the land, the world. Uh, and it also gives me, if I do it in Let's Builds, it also gives me some videos to put up when I when I get done with them. So I can kind of like, you know, record, say, two of them? I don't know. Um, maybe two of them at a time? Do I get that one? Let's go for... Let's go for the X one. Let's go for the X. X marks the spot type of thing, that one there. <laughs> could not see it at all. That looks weird as hell. Let's go with the plain frame. I don't know. None of these are really looking that good for me. I'm, I'm not thinking thinking they are anyway. Um, right. Sorry. Chat, dudes. I've got to get back to the chat. So he's an ironsmith, so he's going to have uh, the dark stuff. He's also going to have, uh, obviously, item frame thing. What I was thinking is, like, putting on a thing like this that has a not really too sure what I'm thinking actually <laughs> <laughs> uh, a thing that goes to a thing uh, 
Yeah, this kind of works. Okay. Um, now we were going to have him as like a minor minor blacksmith, weren't we? But so I think like an anvil will actually probably be the best for him. Now what happens if I put one of these in? Oh, it kind of sticks out. And it's teeny. <laughs> it's teeny tiny. Right. So we we won't go with that. Uh, try the normal one. Try that one. Yeah, that one doesn't really work. It's like a chalice, really, actually, upside down, isn't it? Alright, okay. Uh, hammer, then. One of these has got to work, hasn't it? Hmm. <laughs> None of them work the way I want them to. Okay, it's going to be... I don't think pitchforks are going to work, work the way I want it, either. I'm just thinking, do we go with a tool that looks like a hammer? That doesn't look like a hammer to me, so... Yeah, that's not going to work. It also looks like an axe. God knows. Sorry, guys. Right. Uh, uh, we've got Arwin. Oops. J did you? I, I can't get that, dude. I'm really sorry with your last name. I cannot do that. Uh, Tyler from State, um, State Farm's got to go. No worries, man. Thank you very much for coming on. Um, Sheila A, that angled buildings work well. Yeah, some of them do. Um, really do. Thank you very much, Commander Lies, for now following me on Twitch, man. Thank you so much. Um, I have a plan never. No, I don't, Sheila. I don't at all. We've got uh, Robert Harper as well. Uh, hi, Ducon Red. Love the channel and the way you build. I'm not Ducon Red. <laughs> uh, yeah, Lucrania77. Uh, thank you so much for the follow as well earlier. Uh, which I saw. We've got Commander Lies. We've got Christian Schrader. Um, Shula A, mini series like the Homestead. I need to do that. Homestead. Homestead, I need to finish. That was the first one. That was what we were going to do. That. that was the first build on here. And it's just a house. I think it's in totally the wrong place, though. It's because I just picked a place and started building. I didn't think about anything else, so I've got a bit nuts. Uh, Critical Change, could I please try and tutorial the Akira class starship uh, from Star Trek? I will at some point uh, get on back onto the Star Trek, and I will do an Akira. I quite like it. Out of all of them, um, it's one of my more favourite ones, and it's smaller. I just always thought it looked cool, because uh, it's got the kind of like, it's like a, a, a shovel kind of shape, isn't it? It's kind of got that, well, not like that, it's like that kind of shape, isn't it? Like the diamond shovel kind of thing, it's really cool, like that, that kind of thing, so that's quite cool. Uh, Big Mac, gotta go, it's late, I've been here in Finland, no worries man, thank you very much for coming on. I did not realise that you're finished, Big Mac, I did not realise at all, so yeah. Um, David Smiley currently working on any new ship designs. Only the, the Queen Anne's Revenge. That's the only one at the minute. Uh, there's no other ones at all. I uh, just haven't got the time. I just haven't got the time at all. So, anyway. Drunk Yoda from Finland as well. Cool, we got two Finnish guys. Uh, the Tiny Anvil, another name for a pub. Uh, that would be pretty good actually, wouldn't it? The Tiny Anvil. Um, what about Bellows in the sign? I bet you it just does the weird sticky outy thing. I mean, we can totally try it. I don't know why I walked around here for it, either. There's gotta be stuff that people use in default Minecraft, for God's sake. It just looks weird, doesn't it? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> Princess Miranth. I like that shoe, eh? Uh, the tiny anvil, a place to get hammered. Absolutely, yeah. Totally works. Oh, Commander Lies, you don't look at my picture from Discord. I wouldn't have known that either. You know I'm going to forget that, right? Because if your na name's not the same, I can't. I, I just can't tell. Um, Lucrania. Lucrania? Is it Lucrania or Luciania? I don't know how you say it. We've got Ben's Ben's Cuddly Toy. Okay, cool. Uh, we got got um, Nin Simmer as well. Nine Simmer? Nin? Nin? How do you say that one? All right, need, we need a... What do we have for, like, other stuff. Because materials wise, I have no idea what I've been using. Oh, okay. Well, I'm not using that. <laughs> what, what did I have in this one then? Let's use whatever I had in this Because I think I need to switch that now. Maybe the drunken dog. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, okay, so we went with that one. That was always good. And actually, yeah, we could do with some beams. There we go. That's giving me an idea. Um, So it's pretty... It's going to be very snug up top. Uh, unless we like cut it in a totally different place. So this one, that's that does not 
does not seem right. <laughs> I'm going the wrong way. What? How have? No, 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 no. No, it has got to be. It's got to be that way. <laughs> what? Oh yeah. Wait. No, no, no. You do that. I can do that, can't I? Because where's the where's the pillar? It, this is just. Do you see what I don't do? Oh yeah. Great. Yeah. I destroyed the pillar for an entire furnacey thing. Right, the pillar type thing's on that side, right? And that means that, yeah, it all got moved around. That'll do. I'm um, not doing another beam. <laughs> I'm just like looking at it, just going, I, I've confused the hell out of me. Confused the absolute hell out of me. Um, huh, actually, thinking about this, the more I'm looking at it and going, actually, there's like no space at all whatsoever. Um, I'm just thinking, that's, that's not going to do. What did I do for the roof in here then? Probably the same, yeah, the same damn material. Okay, that's fine. Absolutely fine. I think what we'll have to do is put in some like shelves. We'll just keep it really, really open. Um, yeah, I think we're just going to have to. We'll go with that. Right, 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 right. Sorry, guys. Uh, right. So, Julie, am I sticking with that floor? No, uh, I don't think so. I, I keep on like not looking at it I'm not looking at it at all but um as you can probably tell I'm, I'm doing other stuffs but uh yeah I'm I'm just like thinking it's it's not really working out uh that that floor is not working out for me I hate it when they do get stuff like that where it just messes up the roof uh which is fine but yeah yeah I just I'm not liking it I'm not digging it that's the one isn't it digging it uh, I can do something like that, but then you can't do that there. So you know, with some stupid thing. Who invented this? <laughs> do you just end up right angled interior design things like this? Right? What are you supposed to do? You know? Because I don't know. This doesn't make any sense. Do you know what I mean? Do I just bring the, the roof down so I can smooth it out? <laughs> God damn it. God damn it. Uh, it's Dutch. Don't worry how to pronounce it. Heilhoed. That's uh, pretty much it now. Of all my Dutch, I have now exhausted my entire Dutch vocabulary. Heilhoed. That's it. That is that is it. There is no more. Um, and th that's probably true, actually. I don't think... Oh, for God's sake, I can't even get rid of that one. Oh, and it's a stair, really? Uh... I have a feeling, by the way, guys, this is just going to be the interior, because this is just... This is just nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm going to do some sort of beams, but with these um, going across instead. Something like that. I don't know. Yeah. Well, oh, I've had the house. Um, you go down again one block, so you get an extra block on the top for the half loft. I know. I, I did think about that a second ago as well. Because we can have this at this level, and then we can. Yeah, all right. All right, shoot. Let's do it. It's going to. You know, set an angle anyway, so why don't we just. Um, why don't we just make it a little bit more weird, yeah? And I'm. <laughs> I'm not joking. Let's let's seriously. Let's just make it a little bit more weird. We'll do something like that, or that. That'll do. Right. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's put these in. God damn it! It's so stupid. Angled buildings. I have no idea how Vigor Man does them because Vigor Man. I was like watching. Um, I was watching him build. Uh, what's it called? The place that's in the north, wherever it is over. Where is it? I was watching him build <laughs> this thing. Well, he's building on this thing. Um, and he's got so many just really badass looking angled buildings. It's incredible. Absolutely incredible. So the guy that is the Dwarven Runes, um, which you can't read. <laughs> it says Mystic Pines has to be my favourite series of yours. Love the purple roofs. Really mind me of Majors to strip from Stormwind. It was based on it. It was actually based on it. Um, that's the picture that inspired me. I've never been to Stormwind. My my game's just completely lagged out now. I've never been to Stormwind. I've, um, I've only played bits of World of Warcraft. Uh, and it was the old 
was it old Stormwind? I think it's before it changed. But that entire entire place is, is based off of it. I, why have I got so much lag? This doesn't make any sense. Look, now it's done. It's just that is so bizarre. It makes no sense because I'm like here. Do you know what I mean? That is weird. It's really weird. Really weird. Weird. Um, anyway. Uh, since I'm, I'm finally done, I'm finally done with texturing the walls for all houses. Took me, um, I think, three to four hours to cone come to this point with two people. Fair enough, man. Um, send the pictures as soon as you. Well, not as soon as you get them, obviously, but you know, once you're happy, because <laughs> otherwise you just be like, right, okay, I'm gonna take a picture now and now and now. But you know, you know what I mean. Um, oh, actually, we could have this as stone. We could have this as muddy rubbish. Have I got a good material thing for this, or did I just... I just went with the normal kind of whatever this is. Apparently. I think I'll probably put it down by hand. I kind of imagine myself putting it down by hand for some reason. I've got a, I've got a recollection of that. Um, right, okay, so let's get off of that. There might be Twitter in the background as well, just going off and just doing stuff. Um, which I forgot about. So, uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. what am I doing? Yep, got it. Darwin. No one knows how Vigo did, did does anything. I know he's crazy. Hmm. Clip's dead. There you go. Thank you very much, um, Stitch and Stan. I knew it was something. It might just be my internet speed. Actually, I think I've got really. It's just. It's just struggling. Um, I think my. Like wireless thing that I've got in my PC is dying because I had to. The last couple of weeks actually, I've had to. Whenever I go onto it, I have to um, restart it. I so I'll start the PC up and it'll actually just it won't be able to connect and then I just have to turn that thing off on off again. Just the Wi-Fi is really weird. Um, right, let's get some dirt. <laughs> let's get some dirt and throw it in. Uh, we'll have it kind of like it's a bit muddy. So I think they are going to be quite peasanty, aren't they? These people are peasants. Um, right. Yeah, I'll just do that. It doesn't really matter. Just wondering how much... Um, no, it's there. Okay. I was thinking, like, how much of a hill do we have? Because if we had a good enough hill, I could do, like, a, a little archway type thing underneath the wall, but not, not even got close to, to that much room, which is fine. Which is totally fine. Right, anyway. Damn, Bart, you gotta go. You are asking me when I'm gonna stream. God damn it. That's, that's cool, man. Um, you, you just leave me. I, I, I won't have any sort of, like, uh, you know, issues from you leaving me, man. Just just saying, you know. <laughs> that's not a problem, Bart. Thanks for coming on, man. Uh, we got uh, Mick Gadaletta. Gadaletta. Something like that. Isn't this a server says no... Nope. Single player. It is single player. Right, okay, walls. What have I been using for partitions in the, in the start? I should have really looked this stuff up before because I just haven't at all. So I have absolutely no idea. Oh, that. See, wouldn't guessed. I mean, it makes sense because it's actually, I really like it as a texture. It looks awesome. Um, right, so what I'm going to do, this is going to be like his, like, living area type thing. I think he's going to sell all of his wares outside. Um, he'll probably need a shed or something actually to, to store some stuff. We'll give him a shed. We need to give him some chickens as well. Man needs chickens. So we'll give them all those kind of things. Right, so this here, if we build it across this way, you know, really roughly, then start doing the angledy stuff. Like that. Not that. Idiot. God damn it. Right, okay. Uh... Oh yeah, and then we said about doing the roof thing. Oh yeah, I was supposed to finish the roof. Ugh. Right, put that in there. Put that there. There's got to be a block. That's going to be a slab. Right, okay. I'm just going to just completely just beast mode this quickly, guys. Sorry. Uh, no, unless we did that, that kind of works then. Do that, get that into there. 
get that into there. Slab. Stair. 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 That makes a little weird thing. Oh, I actually did it. Cool. Okay. Um, right. Uh, what else we got? We've got Ali Hadi. Good to see you, man. Um, no red toy yet. Remember something like this, and it was a server. It was kind of roleplay. Okay. No idea. <laughs> no idea at all. But yeah, cool. That was good. Is it? Is it really bad, Chula? Yeah. I mean, I've got like a replacement, the exact same like little. Uh, it's literally like a little USB thing that I plug into it. Um, so I've got one of those. Uh, So I'm trying to figure out where the door's going to go. It's not going to go there. It's just something doesn't feel right about it being there. <laughs> right, I need another. I need another block for the floor. I'm going to go with uh, go with the other one. This one, oak one. So that kind of like dark roof. Some of this got quite a bit of materials going on at the minute, so it's quite good. So we had something like this. Yeah, I'll have something like that. I know we've got that like window being blocked up now, but that'll do. Right. Um, very important. Do I play Cookie Clicker? Never heard of it. Honestly, never heard of it. Um, I've played stuff like Clicker Heroes in the past. I say played. You don't really play those games. You just let them play themselves, I guess. Uh, but they're, they're quite good, actually, I think. At least I, I think they're pretty good, you know? Different. Um, and now, by the way, Shula, I'm going to keep this floor here uh, because of this weird little thing that we got going on in here. Uh, right, let's curve this now. Actually, let's use this to like border it off. Yeah. What the hell did that just happen then? Yeah, just get block instead. Right, go for a block, and then go for stairs on these. These. Get that in there. Block it. It's gonna always do this on the other side. That's what I was thinking. Obviously. Um, so I can always do something like that, right? So looks a little bit strange. Um, that's a block, so we could have the uh, like a ladder going up. I mean, would he have a ladder go up here? I think this is gonna be more storage than anything else. I think it's gonna be like. A bit storage crazy. He's just gonna have stuff everywhere. I, I I can't imagine him being that like busy. Do you know what I mean? Some like that. Anyway. Uh, sorry guys. Right. Uh, what fantasy world will your elven style be rem reminiscent of? Tolkien's eyes uh, are very much different than those found in TAS or World of Warcraft. A bit of bit of a mix of everything. I want to do lots of different styles with the elven because of that reason. Um, there there seems to be quite a good variety. Um, I quite like World of Warcraft things because it, it seems to work with that kind of cartooniness, um, which is quite nice. I, I, it kind of has that kind of like feel to it, so I, I do like do like World of Warcraft -y stuff. Um, it's just then I can really do with playing the game and, and walking around, but then that's that's not good because I won't ever do anything else. <laughs> Maybe. Just have a look at this. It looks kind of it looks different in the picture, but it's not. There we go. That'll do. Oh yeah. Let's not put that on there. Yeah. So I have some sort of like thing in here. I kind of like feel like he should have animals in here or something. I don't know. Who knows? Don't with the roof. Yeah. Right. Perfectly normal roof. Yep. It is absolutely. This is totally normal. Um. Everybody has a roof like this. This is just. What angles do when you when you do angled buildings and you do a messed up roof with your thatch, uh, you then end up with something on the inside that looks like this crap. <laughs> Absolute nightmare. Anyway, uh, bizarre. 
cryptic streams. I like looking in the background, looking for Star Trek ships to, to save so I can um, chase them onto graph paper in the future so I can have a summer project. Sounds different. Um, definitely sounds different. Uh, RKMG, am I going to make a brothel? Not in this place. There just isn't, there isn't the kind of like um, need for it, I guess. You know, not, not here anyway. Why isn't a bed uh, for an apprentice or something in a loft? Yeah, I could do that. Definitely could. Right, anyway. Got any tips on building boats? Oh, man. Um, yeah, let's, let, let me go over to the Queen Anne's Revenge. Um, and I'll explain some stuff for boats. I, I know it's quite a big boat. But I can show you my mistake as well, the one that I was building before. Um, yeah. Yeah, I can show you that. Right, so, boats. Um, what you will think instantly, whenever you start, whenever you see a boat, you will actually think that it is, because of the, the front bit going out, right, you'll think that it's kind of like pointed, so this one, you see, is kind of a bit pointed. Uh, boats, realistically, I don't know what happened to the side to this one. I think I've missed what it is out or something. But um, yeah, that's, you can see this one. It just it kind of goes up at this gentle slope. They don't. They are really rounded at the front. Um, really, really rounded. Uh, again, it's a real shame that I can't show you the pictures from Portsmouth. I have asked for permission um, because I've got a perfect picture of the front of the HMS Victory, like from here uh, and from here, and you can really see the curve on the front. It's so round. It's weird. Um, you then kind of get this like center line that then goes out from that, um, but you do get this like really flat bit. What I would recommend doing is trying to um, kind of like basically starting with like a rounded bit, or actually no, 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 don't do that. Don't start with a rounded bit. Start with some like ribs. So you'll go like one, two, two, one, and then go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and you'll do that on each side, and you'll get like a rib. Um, and then go back, and then the center part of ships as well, they bow out again. If I could show you guys a picture, I would. Um, I just, I need to wait until I get permission from Portsmouth, Portsmouth Historic Dockyard to use those pictures. Um, but they really bow out. Uh, again, I've got a perfect picture where, you actually can't see it on this tool, but where you can see like uh, HMS Victory where it, it literally goes out and then comes back in. Um, it is so weird because cause it's a free decker, you get like such a curve in it. So make sure you do that. The back, you'll notice that you get like the center line type of things. So this you pretty much just pull the way back. Uh, you need to have a rudder on it, which I, I have not done. Why have I not done a rudder? I have no idea. Um, yeah, you need to put a rudder on it at some point. What the hell's going on with this block? Oh yeah, it's underneath there. That's fine. It looks fine. Um, yeah, so put, put a rudder in it, obviously. The back bit, Queen's Anne's Re Revenge is like the weirdest thing because it's just... <laughs> It's just, just a weird shape. Um, I need a normal ship for that. I need a normal ship for that. Uh, and yeah, get your rigging right. Get your get your masts in the right place. And place those down and they will probably be huge. This is actually the right size, that mast. Yeah, it actually is the right size, I think. I'm almost certain of it. Did I not put anything on top of it? Oh. Got about doing this. I know it's a little simple thing, but simple things. Yeah, so do that. Um, but they're very difficult. You need to practice them. Start small. Thank you very much, uh, Casey Sturley, for subscribing on Twitch. I'm guessing. But yeah, uh, practice, practice, practice. Do small ones. Yeah, uh, and look at a lot of them. Sorry, guys. Right, okay. Uh, What is going on? So, Cory Preston wants to see some Dwarven Minecraft or some Gondor. Really like the Rohan series. Keep it up. Thanks, man. Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to be doing some Dwarven. I've got some on my Minecraft Pocket Edition. I've got some uh, little Dwarven builds. Little, little, little Dwarven builds. Really, really small. Right, anyway. Uh, <laughs> Let's finish up. I think, like... I don't like that one. That one's going to do. I think it's going to be a hay bed in the roof for the apprentice, definitely. So shove that up there. 
Might even be that he's actually got, a, there's like a load of crates and everything around him. Might do that. Let's see, redo the Viking Longship. I think the Viking Longship's still pretty good, because they're quite simple, um, simple shapes. So I don't think it's actually, I would do much different. Um, I've seen some pretty cool designs where people have done things with, uh, like making it, making it have, um, what's it called, like a, a dragon kind of shape. That looks really good. That looks really good. How's it going, Vigo? Um, gonna make some more World War Two vehicles. Um, I would advise you get you checking out my update video, uh, so that'll kind of show you guys uh, show you what's what's planned. Um, definitely. So I would advise you go and check that out. Right. So I'm gonna put this light in here. He's probably gonna have a little chest type thing. I'm probably gonna go with the normal head, little head. Got uh, Nelson Corona. How's it going? Ah, so you are definitely now, so that's alright, I'll talk in the chat. Cool. I'll try and do that. Um, it's a shame I can't get, like, auto-subtitles or something, actually. I've never really thought about it before. It's a bit different. <laughs> Vigo, please teach me diagonals. Yeah, absolutely. Um... I mean, this one is. This one's. This one's on diagonals. It's just, and it looks. I. I think it looks pretty good. You know, it kind of like fits and everything. Um, it's got like the whole blacksmithy, blah thing at the back. But the damn roof, the filling in this damn ceiling, because I had really roughed up the roof, uh, so blocking it all up has just been so messy. So damn messy. But good, good. Who knows? Send a hug to Brazil, please, says, uh, <laughs> Chocolate. So I'm saying that to Vigo. All right. <laughs> bit, bit strange. Uh, should we have a thingy in there? Yeah, I think so. Let's have some sort of, like, thing. That's a shame. That's a shame that that doesn't work. Okay, well, we can try and get a trapdoor or something in there. Um, somewhere. Find a trapdoor that fits. It's, only, it's the only thing. I might even just do it like this to make it like just not. Just can't right click it. Okay. Um. So we need to put in like a block there. Let's do that. Go around the outside. Put that on there. Come back in again. I'm gonna do like a horrible thing. And that's his window. That's going to be his window for the apprentice. And maybe that's where he has his, like, candle... candle thing. Yeah, I think you'd have something like more like that than anything. That should actually light up outside a little bit anyway, which would be quite nice. So that'd be quite cool. Right. Grab those. Uh, what else is going to need up here anyway? I think probably cabbages, food, and all that kind of stuff we'd probably store away. Um, so it can't be got to by any sort of animals or anything like that. I just find it really weird that oh well, you can't right click on it if it's uh much thing but why why do these shake? Uh, I know they're supposed to be like shulkers which is some weird thing but I've not really not really looked at them that looks quite cool. That looks very cool actually. Uh turnips and potatoes. Quite a few sacks actually that's, that's too many sacks. Yeah too many sacks. Uh barrel of potatoes right so have a barrel of potatoes also a barrel of turnips, they're all going to be like... See, they're all going to be around, but they're not. Shove that in the back. Yeah, turnips. That'll do. Right, okay. Uh, random crates around. You could probably do with some iron ore or something as well, I think. I think that'll definitely do. Uh, blah, 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 blah. what's the story of this place? Is uh, Max uh, Digivan? There's not really too many, too much stories on this. Um, not that we've kind of like come up with. I have started a uh, what's it called? What is it called? Um, World Anvil, uh, which you guys said about uh, on the Discord. So I have started a World Anvil now, uh, which is really cool. It's a, it's a brilliant. It's absolutely brilliant. I was going to do iron, wasn't I? Did I already put that down? I don't think I did. The iron. That one. 
Um, yeah, so uh, which is just absolutely brilliant. So we are going to start doing some proper lore and everything. And actually tying into that, I think it's going to be a lot easier than what I've been doing um, before. Come to think, it's, that's not going to be down there. That'll probably be in here or something. There or whatever. I don't know. You wouldn't, you wouldn't lug all of that up here, would you? It'd be crazy. So, what else can we have up here then? <laughs> like how it just doesn't change. What's, what can we have there? So is there anything already in that, that bit there? I've already placed one down there, okay. Very strange. Uh, what else can we have up here? Just junk, really. We just need some junk. <laughs> Cauldron that he made. Or something like that, you know? So it just yeah, he just had, has a cauldron. He made one of those, and nobody bought it or whatever. I don't know. Uh, something like that can do. Same with some chain as well. You'll just have some chain kind of like curled up. You know, doesn't really know what it's for. It's just yeah. See that one doesn't quite work as well. Hmm. Yeah, put that down there. Uh, well, what religion is in Silver Sage? Um, it's probably going to be the way I think it's going to be. It's going to be the way. It's going to be more the druidic type um, stuff. So I'm gonna I'm gonna have to really kind of look over the that religion as a whole and just kind of like really flesh it out a bit because I don't like that it's called the way. Um, I'm not too keen on it. I want to have it tied into the druids, but actually I'm thinking of. Having it almost like most druids are, you know, follow that religion and all that kind of stuff, but it's it's not like it's not like set. I don't know. Not really too sure. Not really too sure. Prince is gonna burn the house down? Nah, not at all. Look at him. It's only a little torch there. He's got turnips and everything. I mean, he's well fed, except for the apparently likes cab cabbage. He's really reduced that cabbage down. Really has. So that's the way it is. <laughs> anyway. Right, okay. So that'll do. Let's put in a kitcheny type area. I don't know where the main guy's going to end up sleeping because um, a big honcho, you know? I'm just thinking, can we do anything here? So that's where those are. Right, okay. Same with that, so we can only really cut in there, but he could have a little cupboard, couldn't he? Yeah, we'll have a little cupboard in here. Yeah, something really simple. There you go, something like that, and uh, clothes. Oh yeah, clothes hanger, I always need one of those. Some clothes in here, we'll have a chest as well, you know. Proper chest. There you go. Something like that will do. Um, clothes hanger. I just kind of feel like this is a kitchen because of the way that it kind of like fits in. Just fill that. So I need to think of somewhere for this. Unless I think we're going to have to build him a shed. Definitely. He's going to need a shed of some kind. Definitely. Let's just move that over to there. Uh, for all this kind of stuff. Oh, yeah, because he's got it there anyway. Yeah. Well, I think we'll build him a little shed, like here or something, because um, that'll kind of do. Yeah, definitely. We'll go go with shed. Shed's always good, right? So there we go. Put some stuff on there. White robe. That one. Green one. We'll go with the green one. Right. Okay. Druids fits in uh, with the name Silver Sage. Actually, it does. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. The druids. Uh, the reason we got it over uh, on this. I know I haven't got shaders on. I don't know why I haven't actually. So I usually have shaders on like all the time. Just build them without them at the minute. Don't know why. Uh, I think we might load it up, but yeah, it's because of um, what's it called? The grove over here. Uh, what's this called? What is this called? Put the, I mean, the good thing is I, I put down signs. Elduff Grove. There we go. I would never have remembered that. Let's just put some shaders on. Uh, got, uh, what are they? Oh, Trills. <laughs> Trills version seven ones. So always use that. Uh, Darian Allen, where are the likes, guys? Yeah, thank you for it. Yeah, thanks, man. Um, yeah, please do like the video. It does help. Definitely. Prince is going to be the only one, only um, 
Fit person in silver sage, you reckon? Could be. Oh, fat person. Oh, fat person, not fit. It's because it's FT. That confused me. AK Gamer Row, how's it going, man? So, yeah, the plan is to, um, with the law, I'm going to take it off of uh, Wix. And, well, this should be diagonal. It could be Shula. Um, yeah, I'm going to take it off of Wix and I'm going to end up. Um, like building it all into World Anvil just because it's so much more fleshed out and you get the whole wiki kind of feel to it which is I think it's going to help and timelines they look really cool so yeah this is Eldorf Grove which is one of the religious kind of centers for the druidic religion um, it's all about like peace and harmony with nature and stuff it's more about that it's more about spirity type things um, they do believe in gods but they believe that the gods are like kind of um, akin with nature and all that kind of stuff. It's all like, uh, blah, 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 you know, it's that kind of uh, idea. Um, so we built this like ages ago. We actually, I did want to do a couple more uh, episodes on it because we did build obviously the inside part of it, which was this weird uh, kind of dwarven type style where we have like, you know, all the rooms down here and uh, everything. It's just really dark, but the idea was that this, the, this was built by the dwarves um, at some point, so... It's kind of like messing around with that. I quite like it. I, I do quite like the style. I think it's kind of cool. Uh, I put in a load of like detail on the back here of like really dwarven pillars. This is supposed to be the main room. I actually quite like it. So, yeah, it's quite nice. Um, and yeah, the sacred pool type thing, whatever it is, thing, a crystal. So it's all to do with that. Um, and they're like caves. They're like natural places of power. And and then we got the druid graves uh, up here, which are like these kind of mounds. Um, so druids would be uh, magical dudes. Pretty much. <laughs> um, and I have got a path that goes pretty much all the way around as well. Um, which you guys can probably see. So you can see like the path going from there. Uh, it does follow it all the way around this bit. And it's not been smoothed out at all but it goes all the way around here, goes up here, works its way down and around and all that kind of thing, stuff like that. I was thinking about this area up here having like some sort of old kind of fort which has now been taken over by uh, bandits. So it's going to be like right up on this kind of ridge up here. Um, so bandits have taken it over um, and that's why this path is not walked that often anymore because of the bandits but it could be because it's you know it's a it's a like mountain pass type thing so it's quite difficult but yeah it's got that kind of stuff. There we go. His house should be diagonal, his shed should be sloped, and his basement should be 4D. Yep. <laughs> good, good idea, George Kench. Good to see you, man. Just in case I haven't said hello to you before. I can't remember. I think I saw your name earlier. I've uh, got Liam Bennett, Bennett as well. How's it going? We've got Weeble Nijenhuis. Magical dudes. Absolutely. Magical dudes. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> right, anyway. Let's get on to this. Right, so let's sort out his bed. Um... I think he's going to have like bare fur or something like that, you know. I kind of want to separate his room out a little bit. So this is going to be the kitcheny area. This is going to be his like area down here. Um, so I'm tempted to like have like this kind of separation. He might have an apprentice and he might also have a kid as well, I'm thinking. So I'm thinking, you know, he comes down here. He's got like his little room in, in this bit. Uh, there's no way I can do anything with this, is there? No, you're not ready. Um, but, I mean, it could have a... Can we? No, we can't, really. I think, can we do anything to put, like, a little window in? But, um... A bit stuck, really, aren't we? Unless I put it in there. There we go, that'll do. Not... I don't know if I can spell iron right, that is. So it's like a little iron thing above his bed area. Um, it might be that it's just it's just separated. It's not actually completely separate. Just with this kind of border. Perhaps. I don't know. Um, we'll go with something like that anyway. We'll get some more furniture out. Sorry guys, I am behind on everything as normal. Get behind on the chat. Right, put that in there. Put the... Yeah, we're going to put a whole full block in there. I know I already had the... Had it as well, which is really annoying, but... Put that in there. Get that to be closed. Um, I'm actually tempted to get the door off of that and just leave it as that, so it doesn't draw as much attention to it. 
I think it does at the minute. Uh, we could do with doing some things going across here, lines going across here. And in order to do that, we need to... If we go to there, and then do that there, and then the same here as well. So glad that nothing pings off. Gonna move that on back as well. So no, I've done the exact same thing that I thought I was gonna do. All right, that's fine. <laughs> yes, yeah, so have like this little room in here. You'll have another small room in the back there with another type of bed, right? Uh, Shoot, like, hey, druids are like magical dudes. Could be a quote from of the stream. It is, yeah. Could be the quote of the stream. <laughs> I think that should be. We should have like a quote of the stream, shouldn't we? Kyuga, good to see you, man. Uh, I actually went to sleep, but I guess I stay awake now. It's up to you, man. Uh, if you're tired, go to sleep. You can always watch this again later on. You know, you can always catch up. Um, it's like Figure Man streams. I've been watching those, um, and, and like that was a year ago. They streamed them <laughs> or something like that. Now it's crazy. Um, but I'm only just catching them now. So you know, just chill. <laughs> it's no problem. Right, put like a little shelfy thing there. Probably take it off there though. So I've like a small shelf thing there. It's not functional because I can't do anything with it, but that'll kind of like do. Let's. Is that grass underneath there? It is as well, isn't it? Got it underneath. Ah, Alright, so it's these ones that haven't got it. That dirt's fine though. Uh, let's get some iron stuff. Let's get some iron stuff. Just gonna put that in here. I need to sort out all of this outside as well. I need to. What I haven't done. Um, on a lot of my builds, actually, is I haven't come back in and done all the little little details that we've got to do. So we've definitely got to do that. Definitely need to do that. Um, okay, we'll just give him a stone, stone, um, some stone in his bed part. He's black, so he's going to be educated at least. Some cash. Some stone in his bed part. Oh, you mean like uh, around here? Yeah, I mean, uh, yeah. All right. All right. Alright, fine then. Yeah. <laughs> Happy now. So, something like that, you know. Just, it's just it's happened to walk, walk a lot of it in. I was mainly thinking, like, um, you know, this has been, like, dug out and not really sorted out or whatever. Um, so, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, Stitches and pictures now coming on Discord. Cool, I'll, I'll check that out afterwards, definitely. Can there be like a, a travelling salesman going through Silver Sage? Um, I don't have a candle maker, so get them from somewhere else. That's a good idea. That's a very good idea. Um, I was watching Vigaman again. Uh, he had his his market was almost like entirely made up of uh, dudes with carts that had stuff on it, which I thought was really really cool. Really really cool. So yeah, I mean, can do. Um, the only problem is with Silver Sage is it's not it's not a big town, but we can definitely do that. We can definitely have a uh, somebody that's rocked up, say, here. Actually, let's do it now. Yes, yeah, let's go on to it. Otherwise, I'll forget about it. Yeah, we can do, like, one. And it's, I'm just going to be basically freestyling with it, obviously. But, um, it'll most likely be <laughs> kind of uh, looking like one of the ones that Vigaman's done before. So, we'll have, like, something like this. Not like that. That's huge. Right, if we have something like that as our, like, base cart. Got Mr. Pigeon here. Um, we can then, if we grab the clothes, clothesline seems to work really well. Put a block, apparently not in the middle. I got those blocks there, okay. Alright. This is to help me um, know where everything is, by the way. So I can place everything right. <laughs> there we go. Right, okay, so if we get like that, right. Okay, that gives us a good base. Then we can do um, something for the front of it, which can probably be fence gate type thing. I think it's just going to end up being like a pretty normal one, like spruce or something. Um, that did not work the way I wanted it to work. But maybe if we did like that together. Maybe. Maybe that. I don't know. I know he's kind of blocking in this whole area here, but you know, he's, he's selling his stuff. 
I think he's just going to be a general salesman because that's going to be a lot easier to do. Um, you can definitely do it with like a fold out thing, which is uh, that's like an oak carpet or something, isn't there? No. Carpet. Yeah, there's loads of them. There's absolutely tons of them. With a nailed oak or reinforced oak or something like that. Like to make like a little shelf that comes out, you know? So you have something like that there or probably at the back. I'd expect it to have it at the back. Um, and then do some other stuff. Yeah. Thank you, man. <laughs> Guess people still watch your old streams. Absolutely, man. Even if it was just me. Um. <laughs> could I have a family sword uh, or first crafted sword on wall, if possible. Oh yeah, I could do. That is a really good idea, Jim Bob. It's a really good idea, actually, because if if I, again if I don't do this, I'll forget about it. Uh, I think shield and sword or something. Yeah, you could have it up quite high. Get that on a little angle. Get the sword. Iron sword. He's going to have like a crappy one. No, I think he's going to have a, a proper iron sword. That shield is too big. <laughs> Damn it. But yeah, okay. Let's have... I think maybe that way. But yeah, you're right. It'll be it'll be like the family sword, you know. Maybe they've come from a long line of blacksmiths or something like that. Something like that always works, doesn't it? Venomal, hey, that's my staircase idea. I don't understand. <laughs> um, oh, clothesline works uh, for everything. It's like beam some blocks, which is really useful. That's true. Yeah, yeah, you're totally totally right. Um, they do work for everything, like, I know not here as much, but that's really big. <laughs> it just makes it look so chunky. Mm. <laughs> yeah, you're right, it does. We can get it. To, uh, God knows what I'm trying to do now. Right, anyway, let me get, let me get this sorted. Let me get back onto the thing. What's he going to be selling? Just general stuff, I think. I'm just going to go for a general stuff guy. Uh, actually, you could have a corner, couldn't he? I picked up shelves and no shelves and spice rack. That's fine. Let's go for like a corner type thing, right? Oh yeah. Ah, oh, god damn it, that's so annoying. Ah. Uh, I know it was one of these blocks I destroyed. Okay, so I have something like that, and then he's got something like that little corner of goods there, right? Um, and then maybe you'll have, like, a chest and, you know, he needs stuff as well. You know, he's his, like... Okay, maybe not that chest. Let's go with the other chest. Let's go with the other one. Um, so he might have something like that and he's probably going to be sat on something as well. So we're going to get some uh, carpet. Like a red carpet -y type thing. I don't know why I always go with red. Um... As I always do, but the idea here being, of course, that I can't put that down. Um, let's get the fence gate thing out again. I think it, it kind of worked, so I'm going to go with it. Uh, unless I go with like this instead. So at least I can do that. Have that there. Just does not look right at all. It just looks too flat. Now let's, let's go with the other one. Sort of like a dagger comparatively. Well, maybe they're not a rich family, you know. Totally possible. Ooh, that was cool. So I know I'm not. I know I'm not going to use that, but I've just picked it up anyway. Uh, so let's punch that through there. Punch that through there, and then we can put this on top. Yeah. Okay, so it's got like a little place to sit on. They can build something over this, right? That's what I'm thinking. Uh, because we can get like yeah, we can get like these. Put these on the on the sides of it. Put those on the back, um, and have like a little thing over the top. So 
the idea being that he's got <laughs> it just looks like a really weird little tiny wagon but you know the idea being that you know he'd be here I don't like how I've done that, that this thing at all it just looks so bizarre um, I think probably need to chunky it out a little bit if we do like that right that doesn't look too bad I mean you can even I was wondering can we do anything else to it yeah, I think that looks better already and do we do something like that? Hmm, I don't know. The question is, do we have that on that side? Yeah, I think so. I think we do need something. We need something there. Oops. Just place a little blocks. There we go. Um. <laughs> Hmm. Kuga is this conquest version where you can rename the swords uh, so they get a new texture. I don't know. Is that one? Tw is it? It's one twelve. But I don't really know. Put string under the red um, on top, then carpet can stay. Yeah, but I kind of wanted something that looks like it's got like a you know the bit sticking out. Um, I kind of wanted to make it look like it was connected, which is why I went with the other one uh, more than anything. Use free th fence gates. Yeah, I could do, but. The only problem is you then get like that. I mean, you know, the only other thing is to have them have them more on the side, but then you end up with like this really big looking thing. So I think I'm just gonna go with that. I mean for now. Um it doesn't really matter too much. It is a mini prairie wagon, isn't it? That's what it looks like. That's what I was thinking. I just couldn't think of what it's called. It'll do. <laughs> uh he's actually gonna have a stool as well, actually. I'm just totally decided he is having a stool. Uh, right. Whoops, not there. You know, so he's gonna just be like, you know, sat. I keep on hitting these, that's gonna be really annoying. Uh, keep sitting on here, you know, he's just chilling out and he's selling his stuff. This is what he just does. <laughs> and then moves around. So he'll be going to the city, or he'll be coming out. Actually, he could be. Could be that he's gone to the city. He's gone to High Garden. He's he's come out and he's trading stuff. So I think it's the type of chest which isn't working. Okay, is that what makes it look weird? Is it? All right. What do you think? Just normal chest, or do you think no chest? Because what I was thinking is um, tent stuff in here. That's what I was thinking with the chest. Um, if the texture wasn't really weird. <laughs> if it, if it was a normal texture. Imagine it. Oh, there you go. It looks alright on the side. Something like that, maybe? Oh, or do you think I do need to um, put in the sides or something, you know? Who knows? Who knows, anyway? Give him a bird friend. Oh, he's already got one, really, hasn't he? He's got a pigeon. How's it going, Swedish Dr. Plastic? Good to see you, man. Anyway, we've also got uh, Theo Renner as well. How's it going, man? How's it going? Right, okay, uh, so furnace, need to get this done really. He's going to have a metal furnace for, well, obvious reasons that he is metal, obviously. Um, <laughs> nah, because he's been, he's a blacksmith, so he'd, he'd probably have something like that. I'm looking for other stuff that's not here. Kitchen-y stuff, yeah. Oh yeah, we got we got a good match then, we got th those and those, that's brilliant. Um, right, spice rack type thing, I know we just had the those bits out there, so we'll grab that, we'll grab that. Typical kind of kitchen type thing that we're going for. Um, not really going to go any crazier than this tool. Just get that again. Can I go with that? That just looks weird on there. <laughs> I've just got this block and I was like, I'm going to use it, so I think we'll probably get rid of it. Um, right, okay, so let's go for if it's got stuff like that. It's going to be more food stuff than anything, isn't it? What, right, what blocks have I gotten? To just grab. I need some blocks to just grab. Just grab. There we go. Loads of blocks to grab. That thing, that thing, that thing's good. That thing's good. Uh, yep, yeah, that thing's good. That's kind of good. This will do. All the stuff that we got in here. <laughs> so, um, will I ever add... Um, NPCs to the world. Um, 
I did start to uh, with the uh, what's it called mod? What's that mod called that I was using? Go on here, custom NPCs is it? No, I've got Flans mod. Uh, yeah, custom NPCs. Um, I did start to add them to it. What's the hell's the Flans mod apocalypse? What does that mean? Skeleton. Okay. Weird. Um, yeah, I did start adding them to it. But um, when I upgraded from one, uh, this is upgraded uh, conquest mod. I upgraded from. Uh, I just realised I, I don't know what I'm doing. I think that's my problem. I think it's because I actually wanted to do something like this. Not that. <laughs> I don't like the bottles. I think it's just something like that. Yeah, when I upgraded from 1.10 to 1.12, uh, we had some issues. We definitely had some issues, and it uh, didn't really work. It. Uh, Stuff kind of like disappeared. Um, all, actually, all the NPCs disappeared. Not just stuff disappeared. NPCs disappeared, which was a real shame that that happened. But, you know, it happened. So it's just the way of it. Let's get some benching type thing. Could actually do like a bit of a better bench and we can get rid of that then. Because you can you can end up climbing over it anyway. So something like that. And if we're going to do that, we might as well do the proper bench then. Right, so that's that way. That, means that one's that way. That means that one's that way. And that one's that way. Okay. <laughs> and where's the other bit of the bench? That one there. I do like this wooden desk. It's very, very cool. Very, very cool. It just looks just, just really good. So yeah, pretty good. I'd like to get wrecked. He's gone to Falkhaven, you mean. Falkhaven. I must go to Falkhaven. I don't know why I'm making it sound really, really posh, but it it actually does look quite posh, so that's why I'm going with it, I think. <laughs> Alright. Jug of whatever. Thing of thing. Uh, ale. Yeah, he's going to be... He's going to have some ale. Goblet. No, he's not going to have a goblet. Where's the... That's the one I wanted. Wooden tankard. That's the one I wanted. Wooden tankard. And I think a plate of food, actually, come to think of it, you know. Something like that. Needs some shelves. It really badly needs shelves. It just feels too open, even on this bit. You know, it just doesn't quite work. And I know we've got some more work to do down there, but, you know. We'll get on to it. Oh, I just don't think that one works here. I think I think good old Faithful's going to work a lot better. So we'll go with that. We'll go with it jug. I know the jug of milk would be a bit weird having up here, but it's just supposed to be just like a jug that they have for stuff rather than anything else. Yeah, we'll go with that. Call it Magic People General Shop, says Weeber. Weeber. Yeah, we'll go with that. <laughs> hey, we've got Bank Dank. Good to see you, man. Thank you so much for the comments. You've been giving me a lot of support on my videos at the minute, Bank Dank, so I really do appreciate it, buddy. Uh, we've got Geo as well. Um, you should apply for Builder on Ardercraft. I just won't have time. I, I need to go on Ardercraft at some point to do reviews and stuff, definitely. Um, definitely a plan. Uh, have I made an outdoor toilet yet? Um, Shula will know. Yeah. Yes, we have. There you go. It'll do. Yeah, we do. I thought we did last time. I'm pretty sure Shula said about that last time. Uh, what did you miss? Uh, not too much. We've been doing just interior, really, bank bank. Um, little bits and bobs. We've got, like, the apprentice dude up here, and, and he's just going to be chilling. And, uh, bits of stuff like a cauldron that was made, the, the blacksmith maiden couldn't sell, and some chain. Um, and a cannonball, apparently. Maybe he'd made one of those. and Or he was just making something and he just made a blob of metal instead. You know, he completely failed. Uh, maybe he was trying to make a sword and just kept on bending it. And that was it. But, you know, who knows. Yeah. Great job in the castle. Oh, you like the you like the castle? I quite like it, actually. It was quite... Uh, um, it was very different. I, I wasn't planning on, like, doing one at all. Uh, I was just kind of like... Somebody... On the vote, you know, I was asking for like um, ideas and everything. I think the st the stair looked a lot better. Um, when I was asking for ideas and everything, well, on one somebody actually did say like sixteen by sixteen builds. And I was kind of like that. Actually, sounds 
terrible. And then I was thinking about it. I was going, I've re I've always wanted to do a, a castle that's um, like manageable to be able to do in survival and and, and to be able to tutorial. Um, and that's kind of like why I went with that. Why I actually did it in the end, and it it, it worked. <laughs> I was I was just surprised. I was so surprised that it just kind of like worked. But it did. I was really happy with it. I was really, really happy with how it turned out. Um, even though it's quite a long video, it did take me. I did have to take two days to uh, do it. He's going to be like a bookworm. This one, maybe he, he's, might be the blacksmith's son or daughter or something. Um, and she wants to go to the city. She wants to go to the city. She wants to go to the academy because, um, yeah, uh, High Guard's going to have an academy around here. So it's going to be quite quite crazy. So she's really trying to get out and get out of this village, the small village, and move to the city. There we go, got some storyline. That's what it's about. <laughs> uh, yeah, because you can put that in there. You can put that all the, way up, all the way up there. There we go. Something like that. Let's do a little bit of um, privacy guard type thing. We'll just be around like that, I think, and we'll probably do a similar thing on this side. Uh, which apparently we got to do over here. Well, that's fine. Yeah, so we'll just do like, you know, it's not totally separa separated, but it's, you know, they're like separate rooms at least, which is which is quite good. Um, I don't think there's going to be a... No, we got the beam there, so we can't do anything there. Could do there, though, and that's where the door is, so that's going to look really weird. Yeah, that's not going to work, so... That's where our window is anyway. Oh, I've completely blocked up. Oh man. Okay, let's oops. Let's go through there. That window <laughs> this window is completely useless now. Ah. Oh. Damn it. God damn it. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Anyway. Um Mr. TJ637, I've made a little crypt graveyard for the dead. No, not in this one, actually. Um, the area that I'm thinking of, weirdly, for for the people of Vestia anyway, is... I'll show you. Oh, This was one of the things that I was planning on building like a very long time ago when I was still doing lots of this area. So you can see the path that's going around all the way around here. Um, this goes all the way down to this area here. Now... This doesn't look like much, but inside of this, oop, press too many buttons then. Inside of this, anyway, you'll see there is this whole um, cave. So there's this whole, um, oh, what's this kind of style of cave called? You know, like like you get in. Um, you can hardly see anything in here actually. So I have, it's like pitch black. Um, it's kind of like Skyrim Cave, you know, where you have uh, stuff. So I was going to go with like a magical magical cave, and I was thinking of potentially having stuff in there, like having that as a graveyard for like the anybody that's like honoured, you know, so if soldiers and things like that get taken there, um, and all that kind of thing, you know, and have have like quite a lot of like buildings inside of there, and 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 do it like that, and have it like as a sacred place. Anyway, so yeah. But no, I haven't yet. I've only done um, only done a little graveyard in uh, in Hamburg. It's the only one, that tiny little thing. So that's it. Ooh. So this just really annoyed me. Really annoyed me. Nah, still annoying me. <laughs> so it's something about it, it's just not right. It's better. But um <laughs> just bizarre. Uh kinda Zanister, will I ever put continue battleships? I advise you watch my vote video. Uh, not my vote video, my update video. Um definitely. Uh feed me a medieval community that isn't toxic as hell on PS4. PS4 you're on. That's a shame that it's toxic. It shouldn't be. It really shouldn't be. It should all be you know, pretty good. 
Um, but no, the co Conquest community is pretty good. Actually, the I found that actually over the last five years the community has improved um, quite a lot. Because uh, it always used to be like uh, I'd get like a, a couple comments which were always like weird. Um, that I'd have to like ban, uh, not really ban, but you know delete. Um, but I haven't really had that at all. Not at all. It's it's rare that there's some some bad ones. So it's pretty good. Uh, I think it has improved. I want to put some stuff down. Bear skin. A little simple thing like that. Uh, this needs to go to a thing. Uh, the thing that I always use. I overuse actually, but I will use again. <laughs> What have I been going for with the chimneys with these ones? Uh, oh, just a block, have I? Okay. I can never remember the, what I've been doing with styles and things like that. Go with that there. And that one will do there. So what's going on here? There you go, do that. And that needs to be brought down. That looks alright. That looks pretty cool. That looks pretty cool. Right. Okay. So yeah, she's got this room in here. She's studying to go to the university in the city. Um, I don't know what she wants to be though. What What does she want to be? Have you guys got any ideas? No idea. I'd like to get ready. We'll be starting the palace soon. Ah, oh, Daka got loads more work to do for preparations when a mysterious stranger from a different world stops by parallel universe man that's what it is that's what might be happening <laughs> parallel universe I know I still need to I really do need to um, I stop by I'll give you a shout when I do um, I am thinking of doing that relatively soon I think um, I say that because well then again this week I was I was planning on actually starting other craft tours and stuff like that and it just didn't quite happen <laughs> so hmm it's one of those. It's really difficult to do. So I'll figure out when you, when I can do something. Uh, but then again, I did build that that castle. I think that's kind of like what threw me this time. I don't think this mirror's working at all. It's just not not fitting. So yeah, any ideas what <laughs> what we should do? Switch to the plans. Don't tell the weapon camera broke. It's weird. It just it's only broken with OBS, and I have no idea why. It doesn't make any sense. Not at all. It is just bizarre. Um, yeah, because it, it should be working. I cannot figure it out. So it's a bit of a shame, really. Um, it's on. It's on like the top, you know, um, of everything. It's supposed to be on right now, but it's not. So I have no idea. FPS match output, you know, it's on like its own like resolution-y thing. Video format any, or just pick up whatever. Color range, partial, full, buffering, auto detect, just enable or disable. I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. Just cannot, cannot figure it out. It just does not want to work. It should be. So no, I, d I just don't understand. I just don't understand. Um, shopkeeper. She wants to be a shopkeeper. But what's she going to sell? She's going to go studying. Could be that she wants to be um, something else. I don't know. Hey, Zarius. Hey, how's it going, man? Good to see you, bro brother. Um, have a built a mill, Bank Dank says. Um, not yet. There is one planned, though. There is one planned weirdly on the hill as a I can't see it, god damn it. Uh yeah on the hill. Here you go here. I'll prove it to you. Prove it to you by like flying right up to the sign. <laughs> I can't I can't fly into it properly, that'll do <laughs> windmill. Um so that's why I've planned to build it. It's a, it's in a bit of a weird place. Um uh, it's gonna be on an angle. It wasn't gonna be, but it does not work that way. You know, if it's facing this way that's stupid. It's facing that way, it's a bit stupid. It's gonna have to face this way. So I've gotta do an angle. Ugh. Yeah. That'd be fun, wouldn't it? Really fun. Oh uh, well. That'd be good. Yeah, so shopkeeper. Maybe we should maybe we should, I mean she could be a scholar or something, couldn't she? 
Um, maybe she wants to like you know work within the uh, like a lordy or lord or lady of um, of high guard or something. I don't know. You know, work as uh, in one of those places. I have no idea. Maybe a doctor. Doctor works as well. Just feed me. Yeah, that's a good idea. Uh, so Phoebe says, um, so many booters and uh, everyone on hates each other and none of the community get along. That's just really weird. Like the city and the medieval hate each other. Oh, that's normal. Yeah, yeah. Um, that's totally normal. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's just the way it is. I don't know. That That's always happened forever. It's, that's been a difficult thing. I don't understand it. It's, it's just like, no, I don't like that. Uh, I just do both. So, tough. <laughs> If you don't like one, you just watch the other. That's the way I think about it. Um, right, I'm going to have this little stone. No, I'm not going to have a stone thing. I'm going to have a... I want to have like something religious-like. You know, because one, one of the things you guys were saying was actually about the um, what religion this town is. I haven't got any sort of like religious-type symbols around. It's a really good good thought. Uh, it's just something I just haven't done. Just haven't done. So, let's go, yeah, let's go with something like that, which looks quite basic. Have this there, and we're going to have the pot. A prey to the vase. <laughs> philosopher, yeah, philosopher. Um, that's a good idea as well. Uh, doctor, philosopher, that kind of stuff. Maybe the army sent them supplies to craft um, for the army so they can create, create and shipments around. That's a good idea as well, um, Jim Pop as well. Uh, I'd like to get rid of, if you're going to tour, I prefer the palace interior to be, be done at least. Okay, yeah, no, that's fair enough, yeah. Yeah, give me a shout when that's done. I think it's going to take us, like, two, three episodes anyway to tour the whole thing. Um, maybe more. Maybe a year. I don't know. It, it seems pretty <laughs> pretty busy what you've been doing. There's a lot of stuff going on. So, it's cool. I'm happy with it, so it's always good. Um, right, we're going to have here is they've... They're trying to support their d their daughter as much as they can, right? So they have got some more books. So she's a real bookworm. So she's studying for something. Uh, studying studying for something a lot about kind of thing, you know. Uh, Mr. T J likes the idea of a hall of the dead. Ah, that's what we should call it the hall of the dead, like the 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 grand hall of the dead. You know, can kind of like uh, a real place of honor. Um, they could even be like the a guard for it as well, you know, that kind of thing to protect the dead from, you know, grave robbers and things like that. It could be a, a real thing because that they they are a real warrior people. Um, these guys, they really are. All right, right. Let's just put some bits of hay down. I'm never too sure about this. It always makes it look a bit meh and a bit, eh. but um, yeah. I just I think that looks terrible. Let's just get rid of that. We'll just have it like as it is because it doesn't need a lot now. That wool. Oh, that's that's that kind of wall. But we can put in. We can use it, you know. We can put in, for example, shelves. And uh, we can even do that there as well. So we put in a little shelf like that. That looks kind of cool. I've never done that before. Uh, of course, we can't put anything on it. But as far as the shelf goes, I'd be pretty happy with a cool little shelf. Um, and maybe even a painting. Sounds I. <laughs> oh, Connor. Um, do you build anything from Lord of the Rings? A lot of the Hamburg stuff is is very, um, very, very um, styled on. That's too. That painting's way too fancy. Yeah, I should have something like that though. Yeah, a lot of the Hamburg stuff is based on a Rohan style. That's that's kind of like where it came from. It's is really Rohan uh, esque. Um, Really, really Rohan-esque. Just realise I can push this back, uh, even if I do something like you know, this or whatever. That even, uh, that will just make it look a lot better. So I'm going with that. Yeah, that's fine. So at least that'll make it look a little bit better. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Uh, I need to sort the window, which I just completely ignored in the. Almost all medieval towns in England were Christian. Yes, they were, but uh, here, here it's really different. Um, oh, what the hell did I just do that for? Oh, God. <laughs> I just 
destroying everything. Right, okay, I can't put a window there. Tell you what, let's just forget even having a window in this bit, because it's not going to work. Let's put that down there and put... I'll put another one of those in, actually. It's an orange block. Um, let's, well, we've got the window at the top. We've got the little thing at the back, haven't we, down... Down in here. Yeah, down in there. I quite like that, actually. It's a little thing. Uh, I like to carry it. So I must ask them, are the roles available for females not restrictive like they were in factual history? Depends on the uh, place. Depends on the place. So, because of Vestia, this whole bit around here, um, because of the kind of, like, warriorness about it, right? They've got... Because they've been, you know, mostly attacked by orcs all the time... Um, Similar to what happened in World War Two, really, where uh, you know women got the vote, women were ver like working and things like that. I wanted to do something uh, World War One as well, really. Um, I wanted to have that kind of thing with this, so it's it's a lot less, it's a lot different, um, a lot lot different. That's what I'm thinking anyway. So uh, yeah, they they do. Um, it's a lot more free around here. Um, it's almost like you know, an, uh, like more shield maiden type thing as well. Um, the Nords definitely do. Um, the actual first leader who of the Nords who invaded was um, oh god, I can't remember her name, but we came up with a name for her. Um, yeah, but she invaded down through here, through through this area here, uh, and made her way down and attacked the elves. So she was the one that actually, um, you know, all linked up and everything like that. So it's pretty cool. Okay, there we go. We've got Gobic Roy is getting a ban. Uh, what an idiot. <laughs> Absolute idiot. So give me a sec, I'll just ban this guy. As soon as I find him. Sex goes. And just like that, gone. Took a little while actually. So there we go. Uh sorry about that guys. Hopefully the messages should disappear. Hopefully. Well they should do anyway. Uh, he has also been reported as well, so hopefully YouTube... Well, YouTube do review stuff. And because it's come from me as well, it should have a little bit more weight, maybe. I don't know. Not that I ever hear back from any of those things, so it just never happens. Actually, I'm pretty much done with this, I realised. Oh, except for... I've destroyed a nice painting that she had on the wall. Um, yeah, we'll have that up there. That's kind of like what she's doing. So she's either going to be a doc doctor or something else, you know? Something else. Not too sure. So she could be going to be a doctor. She could be going to be like a scholar type person. Um, I don't think it'll be an arcane type thing that she's going for. So it won't be like magic. Um, the reason being that she would have been picked up by the Majors Guild already by now. I reckon they're going to be like Jedi's, you know, walking around and finding people and things like that. See trolls frequent YouTube as well. Well, that's the first one I've had in like six months. It's weird. So. But, you know, they exist. They'll disappear. Um, but yeah, it has been getting a lot better. So it's probably because I jinxed it I said that earlier. <laughs> so, always happens. Right, okay, cool. We're going to do a little bit more and then we'll we'll be done. So I'm literally thinking, like, the next five minutes or so. Something like that will be done. Um, so if there's anything you guys want to ask me uh, in the meantime, then do. Uh, and I'll try and, try and respond to it as I can while I'm finishing off this uh, floor thing. Fur floors floor, yeah, that thing, yeah, don't think about that. What's that one then? That is that one. I thought it was. Maybe. <laughs> Who knows? Right, okay, um, let's grab that one as well. Maybe she's studying to be a Minecraft streamer. Yes, that would be, <laughs> that's, that's absolutely it. You're, you've got it spot on. That's uh, that's a profession in this world, uh, this medieval fantasy world. 
<laughs> oh, but then again, that's not a career, I don't think. I think you'd, you'd have to be absolutely huge to, to be able to get the return on it. I mean, the main thing for YouTube, if you if you were doing it properly, would be um, um, you'd have to get quite a lot of uh, donations all the time. Um, I think that's the only re way you can actually continue. Because advertising rates aren't great. Um, so, yeah, it would, it would only be that way. So it's not never a career, is what I would say. Uh, never look at it as a career at all. Get a job. <laughs> right. Uh, I'm going to have to pick up that block because it's going to really annoy me if I don't put it down. And it will really annoy me if I just place stuff on top of that as well. That kind of works a little bit. I'm not going to try that stitch and stand. It's just going to be horrible. <laughs> How long will I be streaming for? Not too much longer. Um, not too much longer at all. I'll be, I'll be heading off in a bit. Let's put that in there. So probably, I don't know, five minutes? Something like that. Something like that will do. And then we'll get into something different. But yeah, we could really do... I would love to finish up Silver Sage. Uh, so I'm kind of, I was actually quite happy when you guys said that, because I was thinking it was going to be Hemberg. I was quite happy when people said about Silver Sage, because I was thinking actually, yeah, if we can like get this done, it'd be really cool, because um, what I'm thinking is, you know, we've got this one, we've got this building. Um, I'll build like his hut or whatever, uh, and a little building here. We don't actually have to have one there, but I think it needs it. I think it needs like a really angled, you know, 45 degree type uh, building probably on here, just a little house. Um, I think we decided for... no we didn't. Ah, the logger's hut's going to be there, okay. So I think it's just going to be a guy that works in the field more than anything. So we'll build a hut there, we'll put the logger guy. And that's going to be it for it, uh, for this little village. It's going to be really, really small, so it's only going to be that, those houses. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight buildings. Eight buildings, um, and then the Lord's Manor type thing. But you won't be a lord, you'll be like a, 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 a baron or something, maybe? Or we'll do something like that, I don't know. Kind of something. Then we got the derp chickens. Lovely derp chickens. Uh, and derp cow, of course. So we'll kind of like go on with that. I think it'll be the best thing. But that's uh, not turned out too bad. As a little interior. Quite nice and simple. Doesn't need a lot. Yeah, but I quite like this. I quite like how, you know, they've, you know, kind of like stored all their stuff around here. They've given their uh, daughter quite a lot and they're, they're giving her, you know, they've spent their money on books and things like that. Um, I quite like that idea. And then, you know, the blacksmith's apprentice will be sleeping up here. He's actually got a pretty cosy place. Actually, he's not on the cold floor, but uh, whatever. <laughs> yeah. Right. Gonna be a librarian. Yeah, I mean she could be. She could actually want to work in the arca arcane library or something like that. You know, uh, you know, become a historian and, and historically track things and all the different events that happen because that could be a thing, couldn't it? And sage philosopher is your vote. Yeah, it's quite a good idea. Prince Moran, got to get ready for work. No worries. Thank you very much for coming on. Need to be a tactician. Yeah, that could be a thing as well. Actually, yeah, it's a good idea. Um, right. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, I think that's gonna be it, guys. Um, yeah, thanks for thanks for joining me today. Um, we've got a little bit further. I know we didn't do the next bit, but we'll get on to the next bit the next time. Um, but I think that's a good plan. Actually, is to Actually, I think I think the next episode of Silver Sage will be the last. Uh, come to think of it, not not next stream, because if we've got this one, we build that house and we build a logger's hut. No, it won't be the last. Second to last, because we'll do the Lord's Manor as a separate one. See, so yeah, if we do that building, do that building. I'll put that up as a time lapse, uh, and then we can do the Lord's house up here or whatever. If we need one, it might be we don't need one. But it was going to be Lord Silver Sage, which is why it's called that. Or uh, and we've got Silver Sage Mine, it's kind of like named after their family. Uh, they could be quite an old family. Or they could be quite a new family that's renamed the mine, actually. That would make more sense. Yeah, that would make a lot more sense. I need to rough the floor up in here. 
Something like that. I don't know. That's how it's going to go. We'll see. Cool. Alright, guys. Um, anyway, have a good night. Uh, or a good day, depending on where you're actually from. Because I know somebody was having a, you know, on their coffee break. Um, and we'll kind of, like, keep on going with the whole thing. Uh, she might need a ca candle in her room. It's too dark to read. That's true, actually. Yeah, no, you're right, Jim Bob. We do need to sort that out. We do need to sort that out very, very quickly. Uh, right, okay. Books. Throw them. Um, let's move our chamber pot. <laughs> Put the books there, right? And we'll have one of... No, we'll have a little lantern set, I think. Whoa, that's bright as hell. Yeah, she's got a little, little lantern there. Uh, no, I think, I think candle's going to be more... <laughs> more realistic. Actually, if she's reading a lot of the time. Loads of candles. Yeah, we'll go with that. Good idea. Right, cool. Thanks, guys. Uh, see you later, Zarius, as well. Thank you very much for coming on. Um, and Banknook says, Duck, no problem about commenting and helping out in the comments. Um, thanks, buddy. Yeah, I really do appreciate it, Bankdunk. I really do appreciate the support on, on my vids, because you've been pretty solid, man. So, um, it's always good. Anyway, see you guys later. Bye, 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 bye.